Jasmine takes out a $240 simple interest loan for six months and the interest rate is 11% per annum. How much will Jasmine pay in interest at the end of six months? Now we use, we use the same um, formula, I is equal to P times R times T. So P is equal to $240. Now R is equal to 11% or 0.11. And T is equal to six months. Now, this in formula, T is always in years. Now, um, Jasmine only borrowed it for six months, so we have to divide that in 12. So, T is equal to six months over 12, or this is equal to one half. So, now we plug in our um, numbers into the equation. So, I is equal to P, which is 240, times R, 0.11, times T, which is one half. And now we um, punch it in into our calculator. So we have one half times point eleven times two hundred forty, and it's thirteen point two dollars. So I is equal to thirteen point two dollars. Susan invests $1,500, leaving it for four years at 3.5% interest per annum, simple interest, and find the future, future value of the investment. So the formula for simple interest future value is A is equal to P times 1 plus R T. So we list our parameters p is equal to 1500 r is equal to 0 0.035 and t is equal to four years so now we plug it in so a is equal to 1500 times 1 plus r 0 0.035 times t which is 4 so now we plug it in. Uh, we um, I mean, punch it into our calculator. So we multiply 0 0.035 times 4 plus 1 is equal to 1.14. And then we multiply it by 1500 times 1.5. And this is equal to 1710. A is equal to 100, 1710 dollars.